guys, what's flipping good? It's your boy Jay Plays Games here, and today we're going to be showcasing a certain game I found trending. I downloaded the app, and I, 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 yeah, it was a pretty good app. So today I just I found out a glitch in the game that I want to share with you guys. It's been this game hasn't been out for too long. I downloaded the first one at first. Don't download Hungry Shark Evo. Download the more like. How do I put this? Like more pixelated one with more pixels and like frames per seconds and whatever. But hungry shark, I have maxed out this shark, and I just wanted to show you the tech. So I've had this game for three hours, roughly now, and in three hours I didn't get a small shark, I didn't get a little medium shark, not a large shark, not an extra large shark, but I got the great white shark and today I'm going to be sharing with you guys how I did this so the two things you need is a device you need settings oh, I just got rid of settings you need settings as I was saying and yeah you just need hungry shark so I don't know if this can be done on Android it probably can't so just to put that out there but what you want to do you want to go to date and time so if you have both of these on, take set or ma set automatically off. Just take it off, slide it. Then you want to do is set it to random date. It really doesn't matter. It can be any day. It just has to be before the day, which is your current day. And then go back to the app. Let the you have to let the fins move. Go back on. Then just do this. Flick it back on. Then flick it back off because that will take ages to load. I'm not even joking. Go back onto the app and you should be rewarded with five gems. As you can see, my gems went up. And boom, that comes up. Then you can just do this repetitively over and over again. And I got to 1,500 gems in about half an hour. So in half an hour, you do people's day work. And now I can nearly get this guy. And it will only take me half an hour to get him too. 1,500 gems. And just to show you this is legit, as you can see, I can go on different apps. I can go on Pokemon Go. So I can go on different apps. This is 100% legit. No photoshopping. I'll even do it again for you guys. So as you can see, set it under in a time. It doesn't even matter. Can be, like, I'll just do this to make sure. It's, I'll just do it to then. 10th of June. I don't even know if the game was out then. Go onto the app. Fins move. Back to present day. And you should be rewarded. 51 goes to... 56 and you also get 100 gems this is not guaranteed every time sometimes it will just just decided to be a bit retarded and give you 100 gold which no one really wants because you know you, you have an unlocked xxl class but anyway guys i hope you enjoyed the video and i'm just going to show you a gameplay now of hungry shark because you need to play this game it's a great game i think we're going to go to the pacific the first map you start you, I might not get a very good score because it's never really busy here. As you can see, this is a great white level 7, I believe. He is pretty gigantuan. So, actually, I think I want to go... I think most of my... Yeah, one of my things is set in the um, Arctic. So I kind of want to go to the Arctic. Because it's a lot always busy there and it's just... Oh, I'm a level 11. So for a level 11, I think you're the same size as a max level-ish. I think it works like this. So the max lower class is the same as the next class is up level 1. I'm pretty sure it works like that. But n except from with the Megalodon, I'm pretty sure. Because the Megalodon is just huge, no matter what. Anyway, let's jump into Pacific. I don't have the Arabian Sea yet. I need to unlock three more sharks. It's kind of annoying. So let's just go to the arctic there's only three maps maybe they should maybe they'll update it and fill in those spaces which would be nice like imagine if they added like the bermuda triangle that'd be cool and then you like space and time map i'll try and i'll show you the free easter eggs in this map actually guys so let's check where we are on the map all right so the first easter egg you want to head to where the h is where this like where the laboratory is where you see this like um I'm not too sure what that's called like a satellite dish or something but you want to head to that bottom left or top left you just want to head to that or maybe we can get hungry for you guys 
And also the advantage of having an XXL shell, you can eat blue and green jellyfish, you can crack through emerald walls, and you can eat XXL, and I'm pretty sure you can have three pets, and you can also, what is it, you can eat whales. So yeah, and you can eat, if I haven't mentioned this already, you can eat your own species. That's not the emerald, an XXL, an XXL shark can do that. The emerald is like shards, like the other Easter egg will be showing you, it's like this material, that material, like shards. You can also destroy machine um, submarines pretty quickly. What I like to do, this is the best, oh, like, I can destroy, this is what you can destroy when you're XXL, you can destroy like these shard type things. But a good thing to do, if, if you're facing a submarine, maybe you kind of just want to find a bomb and then boost it into the bomb. Then the bombs will need to normally destroy it and you still get the points. So that's the way I like to do it. So let's see if we can try and do it in my force field. Is strong. See if we can do it with this one. You kind of just want to, it won't work all the time because mostly your shark will just absolutely wreck the boat. But anyway, I think we should nearly be at, yeah, it's just here. So pretty much what you want to do you want to come to the surface, get that H. Yep, get nearly almost killed. You want to eat something, just to make sure you don't die. Let me just try and get back to full. I don't think it's going to happen, because it doesn't matter. You just want to fly up here. And then, sometimes there can be hungry letters, daily chests in here. And there's normally like 10 to 15 people. Right, that god rush saved me there. See, there's always a load of people in here for some reason. But yeah, that's one of these days. Now I'll show you the other Easter egg. Can we survive, please? Oh, I just stunned a, a seagull. How nice. Alright, let's just, we need to eat some stuff. We are going to die, die, die. Yeah, I think we might have the gem. Even unless I can eat these people. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, I'm pretty sure this um, uh, piece of land is quite long. Oh no, there's the sea. Alright, so the next one is, the next two are very close to each other, so this should not take too long to get there. Let's see where we are on the map. Um, where is pretty much where this N is, in the N area. So it shouldn't take too long to get there, guys. Oh no, I'm starving. Please don't shoot me. I'm only a shark with an umbrella. While I'm in the, I don't know why they would do an umbrella. Oh god, oh, I don't know. I'm not too sure why they would have an umbrella because you're from the water. If you're underwater, you're just going to be constantly getting wet. It's a bit weird. Anyway, back on full health. Nah, well, there we go. We leveled up, and there's an orca. Great white. As I said, you can eat your own species or your own your class, your own class or tier. I got a decent amount. Of, my high score, by the way, guys, is 2.6 million. I know it's not too good, but hey ho. I only played the game for about a couple hours. Oh, two great whites. Well, we should get a decent amount of points for this. And also, guys, eating jellyfish is just a huge advantage because jellyfish used to absolutely. I would be on low health, and they would just destroy me. I'm pretty sure, guys, yeah, this is the bird nest, by the way. You can normally find a, um, I just want to get up there. All right, you can normally find a, you can normally find, well, the bird nest is up there, and you normally find a chest or a hungry letter there, so that's pretty good. I'll try and get to a million for you guys. I don't know if we're going to do it. I think, let's see how far we are from, oh, it's just around here. Let's go around here. Right, so these are the final two Easter eggs in this. These are the final two Easter eggs in this map. So you want to come to this small piece of land, kind of near this, like it's very small. Then you should see Splum. Now it's quite a cool Easter egg, I must admit. What you want to do is, <coughs> excuse me, guys. You want to pretty much. Oh man, I died. Quite depressing. I saved myself. Pretty much all you want to do. Oh yeah, this can also, I just want to point out, this can also be good. Say if you want to get a high score, you can just keep doing this and getting loads of gems and then getting your high score up. But you probably want you to go on here, then you should hear music. I'm not too sure why they added this feature, but yeah, it's pretty cool. And as you guys may, may or may, may not, or may already know this, just down here, 
Oh, my storage is always full. Damn. Just around here. I might not make it, but you can pretty much see it. Yeah, this is pretty much the ice castle. You can't go into it, it's just an ice castle. You know what? I'll just see how, I've never I've only been to this bit, so I'll just quickly save myself. Really I spawn in the water, how convenient. Just boost up there. I know I think you can only go to a certain point. Oh no, you can you can get back in the water. I actually have they've never been this far. Oh, and maybe you may, you probably most of the time find blubberfish here as well because like it's quite a cool place. Where's this TV? Well, there's a TV there. Another Easter egg, and there's a toilet. What the hell can I get up here? I don't know if I can. Let's try. No, we can't. But anyway, guys, that's the end of the video. As always, I've been cool. Get it. Uh, oh my god. I keep <laughs> anyway. I've been Jay Plays Games, you guys have been awesome, and peace. Out.